Tampa is taking their historic streetcars into the 21st century, outfitting them to be part of the Tampa Hillsborough Expressway Authority's Connected Vehicle Pilot Program. Part of what we're doing for the CV Pilot is uh, outfitting these um, historic streetcars with uh, CV technology so that we can help prevent people turning right in front of the streetcar. We're adapting an application uh, that was really designed to only warn the streetcar driver um, inside the streetcar when a car is approaching and making a right turn in, the, in front of the car as it is uh, trying to uh, proceed forward. Uh, what we've done is we've actually put that into the, into the streetcar, but we're also warning the driver now that, that they're crossing in front of the streetcar so that uh, they have an opportunity to uh, avoid the collision. A lot of people don't realize that these vehicles at 65,000 pounds can't stop on a dime, so they treat them like, like regular cars, and that creates a dangerous situation. So what we're trying to do is provide the driver of the trolley and the driver of the vehicle a warning that they're getting too close and that they're, they're putting themselves in harm's way. This is something that's going to be create a safer downtown for us, uh, not only for pedestrians, but also for drivers, uh, helping prevent and avoid accidents. Buses and private vehicles are part of the pilot, but the streetcars were the most challenging vehicles in which to install this new technology. And they're going to take that and route that on the roof to our OBU. We're getting ready to install the three antennas on top of the streetcar. There's one GPS antenna and two DSRC antennas. DSRC stands for Dedicated Short Range Communication. With the trolley rooftop being wooden, we needed a metal base plate to ensure we have a good ground plane for a good antenna reception for transmitting and receiving. One of our other concerns is directly above the antenna will be, there's high voltage, the 640 volts. So we're going to have 640 volts, high voltage, directly above our antenna. And we have no uh, experience with that previously. So we are learning as we go how that will affect. Our goal is to have no interference, there's a lot of work that goes into this. We had to actually remove all the panels in order to run the cabling through the streetcar, so that created a challenge. So when you guys take all these panels off, and you're fishing the HDMI cables. Yeah, it's actually up behind there. In addition to the complex wiring and antenna installation, technicians need to make sure the alerts are given at the proper times. We don't want the warning to go off too soon or obviously too late, so we have to work the timing to be right so that people, as they get the warning, it's at the proper time so that they can apply the brakes or, or move out of the way or whatever the right, right things are to do. Yay! Now, I was right glad to see that. A successful equipment installation means the streetcar is ready to be tested on the roadway. We will have a vehicle approaching from the left. He will turn on his uh, right turn signal and indicating his intent to turn right in front of the trolley. The driver will get a warning in his rear view mirror. The streetcar operator will also get a, a warning on his display. If the driver uh, decides to continue to make the right turn in front of the streetcar, then there will be an additional warning given to the, both the uh, streetcar operator and to the vehicle. Tampa is one of just three locations in the country to be part of the U.S. Department of Transportation CV pilot program, which connects all types of vehicles to the infrastructure and to each other. I'm very proud that Tampa is part of the, the CV pilot. It's really exciting because we're part of the future and we're showing how it can be done. So we're hoping that this um, project shows the benefits that we expect to see and that we're able to provide the data for USDOT to make um, good sound decisions in the future. For more information, visit tampacvpilot.com.